914 on your Thursday morning now. The Alamo, of course, is a subject that is very near and dear to many here in Texas. But do you know what happened after it fell? Fox 7's Tanya Ortega joins us live from City Theater in Central Austin with a preview of the Alamo aftermath. It's good to see you. You look, of course, beautiful in costume. <laughs> Thanks, Carrie. You know what? I might have to start incorporating this into my daily wear. What do you think? And I've been practicing my curtsy, right? There you go. I, I didn't know how to do that. So I, you know, I've never worn one of these dresses before. But yeah, this is one of the outfits that the actors will be wearing. And with us this morning is John Cecil. He is the director of La Play. Tell me more about the history behind this. Well, this story centers on the, it's called Alamo Aftermath. So it's between the Alamo and the Battle of San Jacinto. And it's a period called The Runaway Scrape. And this is based on the story of Jose Antonio Menchaca from his real memoir, where he barely escaped the Battle of the Alamo. He fled with his family during the Runaway Scrape with Sam Houston's army. Then he got inducted into the army as one of the Tejano soldiers. He fought in the Battle of San Jacinto, and, uh, and they won that one. Tell me how special it is to kind of see these history lessons come to life here. Well, this has been amazing because uh, we've seen it turn from a memoir that was originally unpublished and then it got transferred into a play and then evolved into this musical show. And then, of course, if anybody's done theater before, you don't see it come to life until dress rehearsal last night. Well, yeah, let's talk a little bit about, about the show. How many actors do you have here? Uh, we have 11 people in the show, and then we have uh, four people in the band. Um, so, yeah, it's a pretty big production for, for what this is. Yeah. So let's talk about the scene that we're about to see here. Okay, what we're going to see is the character uh, Margaret Davis. This is Megan Ortiz as Margaret Davis, and she is waiting right after the Battle of San Jacinto. The shooting has stopped, but she doesn't know what's happened yet. All right, take it away, guys. <laughs> You can go to texshows.com, that's T-E-X, shows.com, and uh, you can get all the info on the tickets there. Just a really cool thing, you know, to kind of see it all come to life and not just sit and read a book, you know, because all our imaginations can go wild like that, but it's just cool to see our local actors out here doing it. That sounds great. Thanks, Tanya. Go see them at the City Theater.